in life we make choices. For example, if you are given a choice between full payment and partial payment, what would you choose? For example, if you are given a choice between departure and arrival, what would you choose? If you are given a choice between goodbye and hello, what would you choose? If you are given a choice between death and birth, what would you choose? For many of us, the choice is simple. Of course, I will choose full payment. Wala na ko utang. Of course, I will choose arrival because it brings me joy. Of course, I will choose birth because it is new life. Of course, I will choose the complete, the new arrival, the new beginning, rather than the opposite. But today, we are reminded that there are lessons in being incomplete. There are lessons in departures. There are lessons in separation. There are lessons that we can learn from goodbyes. Ascension is essentially a goodbye. Ascension is essentially departure. It involves sadness. Ascension is essentially the end for many people. But because of the pain of separation, because of the pain of being incomplete, how many were they? They were only 11. They were not 12. Because it, there was a perpetual reminder that one was unfaithful. But there is a lesson to be learned in being incomplete, in departure, even in separation. What are the lessons we can learn? The first lesson is, because of the ascension, we are now very, very, very sure that Jesus is God. Because if He is not God, He would not be able to ascend into heaven. Sabi niya sa akin, ay yung fourth glorious mystery po, Assumption of the Virgin Mary. Ganito po yun. When Jesus ascended into heaven, He went to heaven, His true home. But when the Virgin Mary was assumed into heaven, heaven just welcomed her even if she belonged to earth. When Jesus ascended into heaven, He ascended by His own power. When the Virgin Mary was assumed into heaven, the Virgin Mary was assumed by God, not by herself. So ang unang lesson ng ascension, Jesus is God. The second lesson of ascension is this. If Jesus stayed on earth, we would think that the most important is earth. Because Jesus ascended into heaven, now we understand that there is something more important than earth. And that something more important than earth is heaven. Mahalaga na maganda ka dito sa mundo. Mahalaga na healthy ka dito sa mundo. Mahalaga, mayaman, masaya ka dito sa mundo. Pero, mayroon pang mas maganda kaysa sa mundong ito. By the ascension of the Lord, we are taught that earth is not the most important. By the ascension of the Lord, we are told that heaven is more important. That heaven is our final destiny. That our destiny is not the grave. Our destiny is life everlasting. The first lesson, it proves that Jesus is God. The second lesson, it proves that the earth is not the most important. Heaven is more important than earth. And the third lesson, if Jesus stayed, the responsibility to evangelize would be on Him. Because Jesus ascended into heaven, the responsibility is now on us.
If Jesus did not separate himself by ascension, if Jesus stayed continuously here on earth, the responsibility would be only on him. But because he left us and trusted us, then the responsibility to spread the gospel, the, the responsibility to bring God to people is now on us. Three very important lessons we can learn from this separation, from this goodbye. Number one, it proves that Jesus is God. Number two, it proves that heaven is more important than earth. And number three, it proves that we have the responsibility to continue the mission of the Lord because we have been trusted with it. Now, my dear brothers and sisters, look again. When do we learn the most important lessons in life? It is, is it when you are happy or when you are feeling lowest? When do you feel the most important lessons in life? Is it when you are successful or when you are defeated and crushed? When do you learn the most memorable lessons in life? Is it when you failed or when you were on stage and everybody was clapping? The lesson is clear. The most beautiful, the most memorable lessons we learn through pain. Separation, goodbyes have beautiful lessons to teach us. Jesus is God. There is heaven. And the responsibility is now on us. I believe.